So you ever ever wonder how a character inside a video game is ever going to perform like this? This is done using animation montages. So today in this video, I'm actually going to be teaching you and explaining you guys what animation montages are inside of Unreal Engine. So let's jump right into it. So today, the first thing we're going to be showcasing you guys what an animation montage is. As you see that over here, inside of my sword attack combos, I have light sword attack combo. This is an array. Now what an array is, is basically something that holds a whole bunch of logic that goes from 0 to 1 or however high you want your array to be. So you guys would notice over here, if I click on this little icon, for when it comes to my array i have sword attack zero one this is basically set up by playing an animation montage so inside of this montage i have my character playing an animation as well as doing like certain nodes like do damage save attacks reset combos you can do these in regular animations but animation montages are really good for creating like combo attack strings and combo attack array so the first thing you guys want to do in order to create a create animation montage is you actually want to go down to where your animations are set and then you want to click on this little animation right here i'm going to be looking at attack gun underscore one i'm just going to click on this and i'm going to go ahead and right click and then i'm going to go drag over here and i'm going to hit on create animation montage i'm not going to create another one because i already have one created but once you do that you'll have the animation montage right here now if we sit there and we go into this animation montage you know that i have my default slot group which is set to default slot now with a default slot group for the animation montage it just allows you to set up like different slots so let's say for example if i have a default slot and my character have a montage for my character pulling out his sword i kind of want that set to my like my right hand or my upper body so this just allows you just to layer the animation just in different slots now the way that you get animation montages to work inside of your game because some people would probably like try to make an animation montage and be like yo i go put this inside of my code it's not working because you guys can actually call an animation montage just from your code in general, but this is how you get them to work, right? So I'm gonna go over here, I'm gonna go into my character's blueprint class. So now inside of my character's blueprint class, if I go over here to my anim graph, you guys would notice that I have this little node right here, which is slot default slot. Now in order to sit there and use animation montages inside of your game, you need to create this node right here. So what you just type in, you just type in slot, and then you click on this right here and it allows you to create a brand new default slot. And then what you do is you sit there and you take this node right here. Like let's say for example, you take this node right here and I drag it into this and then I drag it into like the node that's all the way down here. That would basically allow you to sit there and use animation montage. You need to have default slots inside of your animation blueprint graph in order to sit there and use montage, right? So once you do that, if let's say for example, if I go back to the code right here, right? And I go over here and let's say for example, I just type in input and I just type in input one, like for a key, right? Just for example, just to show you guys that you can call animation montages inside of like the event graph. So if I go over here and I drag off from press, let's say for example, I'm drag off from press, go over here, I'm gonna type in play montage. And this right here is gonna allow me to sit there and get a play in a montage. This is another node called play montage, but what you're clicking on, you actually wanna get a play montage right here. This is basically a full reference to suggest an animation montage. Go ahead and click on this. And let's say, for example, if I just click on air attack one just for uh, testing purposes, right? Now, if I go back into my game and if I go ahead and hit play and I press one, my character is actually going to play that air attack animation montage one. So that is just a basic overview of how animation montages work. You also can sit there and use animation montages inside of an array as well as make an anim montage array. You see right here, just type in animation montage. I think it's animation montage you can also type it as on a variable type you can type in animation montage and turn this into a variable so this just gives you guys an overview of how arrays kind of work a little bit inside of unreal engine as well as how to sit there and create a animation montage inside of your game now if you guys are running into any issues or trouble please let me know down below in the comment section and i'll be sure to help you out and make sure you guys like the video as well as subscribe to for ghost of entertainment all your notifications turned on and share the video on social media using the hashtag for ghost of entertainment and i'm gonna see you guys on the next one